before classes start. For some students, this is their first time away from, on, on their own from home. This morning, we have some tips for students and parents on how to handle heading back to class. Here with more is author Tawan Perry, who knows a little bit about the subject. Good morning, Tawan. How are you doing? Hey, how are you? Good. Thank you so much. Can you tell me a little bit about this book that you wrote focusing on college freshmen? Well, I wrote this book because uh, as a former college administrator, I saw a lot of first-year students struggling with the transition uh, of their first year of college and so I wanted to write a book that was easy to read but also provide a lot of tips that could help them academically, socially as well as financially. Well that's a hard transition in life to leave mom and dad and go off to school on your own. What are some of these tips for parents and for the students coping with the situation? Well I, I think the biggest thing for students is making sure that they are aware of the resources that are offered at uh, the institutions. I mean there are a lot of resources at schools, they just need to be willing to ask the questions and, and not being afraid to um, fail. And let me explain that because I think a lot of times students believe that high school, it, since high school was easy, college is gonna be the same way, but you're gonna run into some challenges and that's okay. Yeah, so I mean, when you head off to college, it's not usually what you expected. It's not like you see in the movies. So some things that we were talking about that maybe freshmen in college don't realize is that there are a lot of different things that they have to deal with and juggle at the same time. Can you talk to me about the three things that we spoke about earlier that they have to deal with? Well, uh, academically, you know, obviously um, they have to uh, not be afraid to ask questions to their professors. Professors have office hours and so making sure they visit professors if they're struggling. Uh, socially, making sure they just get out there and get involved. I mean, you don't want to stay in your room and succumb to homesickness. And then, of course, financially, making sure that they're not taking out too many uh, student loans if they have to take out student loans. Now, that's one thing that a lot of us students that are out of school now still are feeling the effects of are these student loans. So that's something that's really important to consider while you're in classes. Mm -hmm. All right, maybe a little less spending. Now, there's something else that I think is important for students to know is that they can always go home. So mm -hmm. there, that will always be there. It doesn't go away. Your parents will always be there to support you. Is there anything about that in the book that about how parents can deal with their kids leaving? Well, um, one of the things that I always try to say to parents is uh, when I'm asked this question, I say, you know, stay involved, but don't be a helicopter parent. You know, and what I mean by that is you don't want to be too overbearing. I mean, this is your child's first experience of adulthood and you want to help them transition properly. Now where can people get a copy of your book? Uh, they can get it two places. They can either visit my website which is tawanperry.com or they can go to amazon.com and purchase it. When they purchase the book make sure that they're getting the advised edition. Okay. Advised and edition. Sorry. College Sense? Is that what that's what college it's called? Sense. People can go search that online. Yeah. Alright sounds good. Thank you so much for being here with us this morning Tawan. We'll make sure you go check this out and get your kids ready to go back to school. Now grab the Legal problems are not the end of the